like, you know what, only if the other person would hear it and they would apply it, it would have been good for them. But the reality is, look now, we heard it, why don't we start by applying it? A man, I have time for one more story. Yeah. So this man, construction worker, a construction worker, sometimes they, their sights are so far that you really can't, there is no food to buy, so you have to bring your own food with you. So comes lunchtime and people are eating, the man unwraps his sandwich. And he looks at him and goes, baloney, again baloney, every day baloney, baloney, and he slams the sandwich down. So his friend looks at him and he goes, you know, if you don't like bologna, why don't you just tell your wife you don't like bologna? <laughs> he looked at him and he said, my wife does not make my sandwich, I make my sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> so, wait a minute. You just made a bologna sandwich in the morning. And uh, comes lunch time. And somehow, miraculously, your bologna is a steak or caviar. See, if you made bologna in the morning, brothers and sisters, bologna is what we are having for lunch. Similarly, if that is the type of effort that we are putting, guess what happens? This is the type of result we will be getting. If you keep doing what you've always been doing, you will keep getting what you've always gotten. Mm -hmm. Isn't that the definition of insanity? Yeah. <laughs> to do the same thing over and over again and expecting a different result. It won't happen that way. So what do we do for that? We need time and we need trust. Meaning that in order to apply all the three A's or the four A's, including acceptance, that takes time. You've got to be willing to invest the time that was, you know, we were told about earlier. So we've got to really spend the time because time is where we are able to get all these things accomplished. They say that the average uh, father in the U.S. spends 17 minutes a day with his family. The average mother spends 34 minutes a day with her family. See, and don't mix spending time with being physically together. Because sometimes people can be physically together, but they're really not in togetherness. You know that saying about TV? SubhanAllah, TV has the ability of bringing those who are far away close, but also keeping far away those who are close. It brings close those who are far away, and it keeps away those who are close. You all following? You know, imagine how like, we have got a tsunami, we've got an earthquake, and people come on TV, and you know what? They have three cats and two dogs, and we lived on this lane street, and we had so many. It is bringing close those who are far away. But in the meantime, it is keeping far away those who are close to us. But remember also, people would tell us, TV keeps peace in the house, man. <laughs> what is better, arguing or just, you know what? TV, put TV on and TV keeps peace in the house. So it takes time and also it takes trust. Meaning that the more we express affection and attention and appreciation, that inshallah results in people trusting us more, which means that people will be more open to us. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us half a family, Shara al And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala enable us to apply all these A's and all the teachings of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Jazakumullah khair, hadallahu alayhi wa sallam.